Hey friends! So first, before we get started, we wanted to give a quick shout out to... Moni H! Moni H. Hi Moni H, we love ya! Hey friends! So friends, I just wanted to do a quick video to show you guys what I do to keep Sakura and Safari's hair moisturized daily. Um, I moisturize their hair every day, meaning I just put water in it while our spray bottle that has this spray bottle. And this I use now like uh, these spray bottles that you use to like spray your plants just because it's so much bigger and I just found that I was filling up my bottle constantly and this these two bottles are like so big so it, I like fill them up every sometimes once to every two weeks yeah whereas the other one it was like I don't know every four days it seemed like so anyways this one it has conditioner, coconut oil, and filtered water. And the conditioner I'm using right now is Tresemme. I'm still looking for a conditioner. I want a leave-in conditioner. I think it makes more sense since it is made to leave in your hair that I put a leave-in conditioner in my bottle. If you guys find that um, this mixture that I'm using doesn't work on your little one's hair, like it's making it dry or you just don't, it's not like keeping it moisturized, then you should try another oil instead of coconut oil and even switch out your conditioner if it's not working. Like you're gonna have to just trial and error because I did actually try to use olive oil and so I, I switched up the coconut oil and used olive oil because I thought it would work better but it just, it wasn't really good for her hair. So I'm back to my coconut oil mixture and it works amazingly and also another Another mixture that I use, okay, so this one is aloe vera, half aloe vera juice and half water. Let me go get the aloe vera juice. So this is the aloe vera juice. I bought it from uh, Walmart and it costs probably like, this is in Canada, so Canadian dollars, it costs me like eight bucks, I think. So it'd probably be cheaper if you are in the US. I know they sell it on Amazon. I'll have a link in the description box. But I use this. I use this half water, half aloe vera uh, juice when I am, say, uh, before bed and I want to put some of my Shea Moisture Mixture in, I'll use this instead of the other spray bottle. This spray bottle with the coconut oil and conditioner in and water, I use it like in the morning when I'm doing hairstyles. And another thing that I do to keep their hair moisturized is this Shea Moisture Mixture. You guys know how much I love it if you watch my videos. Um, this stuff, oh my goodness, this stuff is pretty darn amazing. Like, uh, I use this in her hair two to three times a week and Safari's hair as well. This one has coconut oil, Shea Butter, and Shea Butter is the jam. You wanna make sure you have Shea Butter. Put a little bit of castor oil in it. Now friends, also again, I wanna say, if you make this mixture and it doesn't work in your hair, it's like just drying it out or you just notice the curl pattern is wrong, all wrong for her hair, it's not the same, you gotta try different mixtures because everything that I use in my videos is not gonna work for your little one's hair as in the mixtures part, like the, the, the ingredients that I'm using. But let me tell you, if you do use a spray bottle every single day and you find one that works, the mixture that works, the, it is going to do tremendously amazing results for your little one. But so Sakura and Safari's hair are different textures, but I still use a little bit of this in Safari's hair. I don't use much, but it does, it, it just makes her curls pop. So friends, I just wanted to show you how I keep her hair moisturized when I have her hair say in cornrows or single braids. I just take the spray bottle and I just spray her hair all over that's it. I don't get it like soaking wet. I'm just spraying it lightly just to get it all nice and moisturized. And then now friends, if you watch my videos regularly, you will always see me spray her hair first before I put a style in it. I just get it all moisturized everywhere. So yeah, that's what I do um, before I get a style in in the morning. Just moisturize it all nicely. 
So friends, I just get the questions a lot, you know, how do I keep my little one's hair moisturized? And actually, I should mention, I do the same thing with Safari's hair, even though her hair is like a softer texture than Sakura's, I always moisturize her hair, and I swear that's what helps their, their um, curls pop, that's what helps the health of their hair. But the key thing is, friends, is to make sure that you are being consistent, doing it every single day. And there is going to be times that you can't do it because she's sick or because you're too tired or you're sick. Like, there's days that I have missed, like, um, you know, one or two days here and there. And it doesn't, it doesn't hurt her hair at all. So don't be like, oh my gosh, I missed a day. If you miss a day, just get back on it and trust me you will see amazing results. I've got emails from people who said that they have seen their little one's hair start growing or, or they've had like amazing results with the health of her hair. So my friends, I hope this video helped you. If it did, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more hair tutorials. We love you.